Hi. Hello. My name is Colleen Delafleur. I live in Shenandoah Shores. I want to thank you for hearing us out this evening. I know there have been many speeches, but I just wanted to share my personal experience and my own two cents. Um, last spring, I was newly pregnant with my first child. She's now six months old. Um, while I was at the library, which I love and have greatly benefited from, I wandered for the first time to the children's section and was delighted at how sweet and cozy it is. And I imagined bringing my future baby there and my future children. For me, I know the library was a wonderful experience as a child. I would go there every week and check out whatever books I wanted to. My mom would glance at them to make sure they were okay, but they were barely ever rejected. As it stands now, I would not be comfortable bringing my children to Samuel's Public Library. Um, I want to echo the point that Mr. Kuplak made earlier, which is that the goal is not to defund this library, but for these books to be removed. And if we need to defund for a short time in order to do that, then that's what needs to be done. Um, I know Maria just brought this up, but I also wanted to quickly address the statistic that was brought up in another speech, something like 27% of LGBTQ members um, committing suicide. And I know that might not be the exact statistic. I didn't catch it. But I just want to suggest for those that have said that we are motivated by hate that this movement is, I just want to suggest that we are truly motivated by love and concern for individuals who may be drawn to a lifestyle which does not promote health and happiness. Um, so out of love for our neighbors and most of all our innocent children, let's keep the children's section of our library G-rated. I thank you for your time and I trust you will make a careful decision.